Hello everyone, it's me, David Klopic, and today I'm doing my first collab video with my cousin who also has a YouTube channel. Ladies and gentlemen, Savage Sir. First of all, happy holidays to every single one of you. And in today's episode of the David Klopic Show, we are going to be asking each other some random questions. Oh, come on. <laughs> In today's episode of the David Klopic Show, we are going to be asking each other some random questions Generated from the interwebs Uh, <laughs> yeah, let's go with that, interwebs Anyway, without further ado What's it going man? Let's, let's start it up Oh, you took the words right out of my mouth Let's go Let's, let's go, go. So let's get started in asking each other some questions. All right, I will start. I will start first. Okay. So first of all, what things are you passionate about? Oh Jesus Christ! Um, you know, I like. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, okay. I, I guess um, uh, computers. I guess you know. Getting, I'm kind of interested in computer sciences, you know, yeah, stuff that, like that, you know. Yeah, I, I feel you, you know. I feel you. I feel yeah. you. I like it. I like. I like it so as yeah. well. You know, it's good stuff, you know. So, uh, do you play any sports? Uh, well, uh, not really. I'm not really a fan of sports or anything. Come on, a little bit of hockey. What? What? Come on. No, no, <laughs> no, so I don't. Really I don't. I, I actually. I actually play badminton. Oh yeah, that's good. I, I used to play a lot of badminton, but yeah, good yeah. stuff. Yeah, but what what do you play? Uh, I mean, is there hockey or something? Well, I don't know. Well, in Canada, yeah, everybody plays hockey. But no, like, I usually just sometimes with friends play soccer or basketball. Nothing much, honestly. Oh, well, that's okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't really train anything. I just play when I feel like it. Same here. I don't, I don't train anything. I mean, I used to play football, but that, that stuff just yeah. really got me bored and all. Yeah. So, yeah. Especially playing as goalie. That shit sucked. All right, so I will now ask, if you were the opposite gender for one day, what would you do? Oh my god, um, I don't fucking know. I honestly don't know how to answer that. I don't want to be the opposite gender, but... You know what, I, I, uh, same, that's one... Like, I, I don't know how to answer that, I don't know what I can do, like... Same here. Okay, if you could choose your last meal, what would it be? Bro, it would be chivape. Not gonna lie, chivape all day. Like, <clears throat> how can you go wrong with chivape? It's the most simplest shit. And maybe some the uh, rice and macaroni, and that's good. I'm good. Yeah, chivape, <laughs> chivape is definitely the best thing. Oh, yeah. by the way, and, if you and don't and cake. <laughs> yeah, if you don't know what chivape is, it's basically it's like, like some sort of. Uh, it's like little sausage, sausages this this big. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's right. It's like shit you eat in Eastern Europe, you know. Good stuff. Yeah, <clears throat> it really is. All right, are you a risk taker? Taker, what is your biggest risk you ever taken? Oh, okay. Uh, I had I had a lot of risks though. I remember when I when I, I'm still going in middle school, by the way. So I used to like um, had a teacher uh, that uh, really hated all of us. It was from music. It's a great teacher. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, uh, and so uh, one of my one of my students asked me to uh, risk myself to save some guy from um, having an examination or something like speech examination. Oh, okay, yeah, I think I know what that is. Yeah, and then uh, I risked it. I just uh, raised my raised my hand up, teacher. I would like to like do the examination. And then she asked me a bunch of questions, and I didn't know a single answer. To, I mean, I did know answers to the questions, but really... Or you, like, you didn't really have an understanding for them, right? Yeah, uh, that's it. And uh, she said, you could have gotten an F for this one. Even though in, uh, in our country, 1 is the worst grade, 5 is the best grade. In Canada, they just use percents. Oh, okay. So basically everything under 50 is a fail. Uh, well, that's, or F for one. That's that's reasonable enough, yeah. I guess. All right, here's another one for you. What's the worst thing you can say on a first date? Worst thing I can say? Uh, <laughs> do you play video games? Because I don't think very many women do that. But 
Yeah. <laughs> it would be pretty cringy to for that to be the very first thing you ask. Right? Yeah, at the or very one, first one thing. One thing that would be extremely cringy to ask on a first date if is to ask like, "Do you want to go to bed with me?" <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. Off. Just 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 sit down and just be like. Do you want to fuck? <laughs> yeah, that, that would just be so cringy. The the chick would just walk exactly. out. Exactly, she she would her. first slap you in the face, yeah. and then she would like like fuck this yeah, guy. That would, that would definitely be the worst thing. Yeah, to I say agree. on the first day, even worse than the first thing I mentioned, like. Yeah, at God least damn. at least you can ask that if a girl plays video games. Some girls do play video games, but yeah, those are very it? rare, by the way. And it, to ask you right off the bat is kind of weird. I mean, you'd want to talk about other shit, but. The, for the the second thing we talked about was just like that yeah that's the worst thing honestly yeah it really is <laughs> all right uh what is the longest amount of time you've ever slept for oh well uh i usually sleep only for eight hours or nine depends but um uh i actually sleep the longest when uh when i travel somewhere up to like 11 hours i guess Jeez. yeah <laughs> I, I i would like for the most for me would be nine hours like a lot of t sometimes I wake up after like six hours of sleep. Like, I don't know. We have a big difference of how long we sleep. Yeah, I sleep. I, I sleep as well. Like six hours, especially when it's school. Like yeah. you have to get up so early and all. Yeah, but that's that's basically for me though. Now here's a good question: Are you smarter than your parents? No, no, no way. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a dumbass. Oh. <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, that well, that's that's reasonable. Yeah. All right. So, how do you think the world will end? Oh God. Okay. Um. Well, pretty much some some parts of the world are probably going to be destroyed by a volcano, like um, uh, like the Fuji Mountain in oh, Japan yeah, yeah. and all the stuff. Makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, and other otherwise, maybe a a giant earthquake will come and like splits the whole planet in half or in quarters or I don't even know. Massive rains that flood the world. Everything, like, oh god, don't even. That's so much, so much ways to destroy the world. But we, we must not allow it. It's the only place where we live, and uh, there's no other place. Like, how can you live on Mars? Yeah, like, what, what the fuck are you gonna do on Mount Mars? How are you gonna take like a morning walk in Mars? Yeah, exactly. Are you gonna be and... floating around and shit, just saying <laughs> hi to the next door alien? And, and another thing you didn't mention is nuclear war. Oh. That's a that's a big possibility, especially nowadays. But yeah, that's that's. I'm, I'm not gonna say anything right now. But yeah, I guess you're right. That's, that's just can't... one. That's just one example I thought of. But yeah. Yeah, that's really a big deal. Or the whole planet just goes underwater. That's another thing. Oh well, oh, I said that with the floods. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. If you had to give yourself a new name, what name would you pick? Spice. Stop. Okay. If you had to give yourself a new name, what name would you pick? I'd pick Spicy Ricardo. I well, mean, you can't go wrong with the name Spicy Ricardo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. That's a good one. Yeah. Uh, and as for me, really, David is my favorite name, actually. I, I like when people like, call, hey, Di hey, David, how's, what's up, and all. Or even David, I mean, everything's the same. Every yeah. single country has different meanings of David. Yeah. And did you know that David meant beloved? Wow. Yeah, but... Fast facts. <laughs> All right. What website do you visit the most? Well, I visit YouTube and I visit DeviantArt. If you know what DeviantArt is. Yeah, I know what that is. Yeah, but YouTube the most, especially when we watch fa funny videos and all stuff. Yeah. It's so good. Yeah, same. For me, it basically would be YouTube, but I like the dark web. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, it's basically just YouTube for me, and yeah. Yeah, I know. YouTube is life. Yeah, or or maybe. That piff. Let's do some mix mixtapes. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, but for the most part, it's YouTube for me. Like, it's just a fun site. Just to look up what YouTube creators are doing. Just, there's so much shit to do on it. You can spend like hours just watching shit. Yeah, that's right. If you could be any celebrity, who would it be? Uh, Chief Keef. Chief Keef? Who the <laughs> fuck is that? <laughs> it's just a shitty rapper that nobody cares about, but. Uh, he's got a nice mansion. All he does is just fucking do nothing. <laughs> <laughs> do you shower in the morning or the evening? Uh, for the most part, evening. But 
on weekends, sometimes in the morning. It's refreshing. Uh, well, some something is the same with me. I I usually take baths in the evening, but one day it was like in Monday, I guess I took a bath in the morning. Yeah. I just woke up and like, oh my god, I st I smell so bad. Go grab the go grab the shower as fast as I can. Oh yeah, I know those days. <laughs> All right, do you believe in a higher being? Uh, well, I do believe in God that everything is possible. And most likely, a lot the love in for, on first sight. What about you? <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, I guess I believe in God and uh, aliens. <laughs> I like um, aliens are watching us right now, man. Oh. Gotta look. Nah, I'm just fucking with. But no. But yeah, I, I yeah I believe in God. And oh. yeah, I guess if aliens and ghosts count, I believe in aliens. But I don't really believe in ghosts. Yeah, me me neither. All right. So, what is your favorite childhood memory? Oh man, um, back in the day, like two thousand nine, two thousand eight, when uh, me and my friends would just f fucking run around, <laughs> run around the park with dollar store guns, and we'd oh. go go home and play some fucking Uncharted two. I don't know. It was just so much fun back in the day, two thousand nine, two thousand eight. Two thousand and nine. Yeah. Oh, those are good times. S specifically on summer break, like that shit was awesome. Yeah, summer awesome. breaks. Everybody knew each other in the neighborhood. It was so much fun. Yeah, I feel you. Even though I don't quite remember what's my favorite childhood memory, but everything is just the same. Go on the Wii U when you... I mean, no, not the Wii U. I meant to say the Wii. Uh, the stick one. The With the stick one, and not the gamepad one. Yeah. Uh, that one. That one is dying right now, unfortunately. I mean, Wii is dead already, but... Boy, Heaker, here comes that Wii Switch, whatever it's called. No, it's not called Wii Switch, it's called Nintendo Switch. But oh well. Good uh, stuff. Good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Good stuff. Yeah. Pre order now, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, you wonder how much will that shit cost? Dude, like, when it first comes out, it's probably gonna be like 500. You know Nintendo. And it's probably not gonna have, like, the best graphics out there, but whatever. Well, that's We just... don't even know yet, so. We'll, yeah. We'll just have to see. Yeah, we just have to wait and see. E3, get hyped. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, uh, describe your favorite type of pizza. Uh, my favorite type of pizza is the one, obviously, without shrooms. I hate them. Yeah, I fucking hate mushrooms too. Yeah. And uh, I, I kind of don't like olives, even though they don't seem that bad, actually. Mm. But um, I never tried them before, so I don't really know what they taste like. Yeah, for me, like... I remember trying this pizza and it was like curry chicken pizza and it was so good. It was so different. Like it's not pepperoni, it's not cheese pizza. It was like, like have you ever tried curry? You know what curry is? What? Curry chicken. You know what that is? A uh, chicken. Yeah, yeah, I know that. But like, they're, they're just, I don't know how to describe it. It's just something. I hopefully the viewers know what the fuck I'm talking about. But like, it was so good. Okay, okay. I hope you know what he's talking about. Okay. Yeah. All right, because I I kind of don't understand, but I guess it means like chicken. Yeah, go Google something. search. Google search, do your best. It's got you, man. All right, uh, would you want to know when you'll die? Actually, no. I don't want to. I I'm, I will be scared if I even if if I get the actual day when I'm gonna die. I'm gonna be scared until that day comes and then I die. And you know what will be the worst part? The worst question would be: Would you want to know? How are you gonna there die? There you go. There you go. It, and that, that's the thing. Um, like knowing when you're gonna die is one thing, but knowing how you're gonna die. Like, what if you're just in your room on the day you're supposed to die, and you're just scared because you don't want to go outside because someone might shoot you or some shit. And suddenly the roof just comes down on you, and that's how you die. <laughs> yeah. The most unexpected way ever. Yes, so, exactly. So you know. Two different things. Yeah. So I wouldn't even know how to answer that myself. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't know how to answer that this way. Well. I'd just be scared too, so I'd just dance the same way you did for that. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever been in love? Yeah, but... Uh, it's a secret. Yeah, I don't, I don't have I don't have a girlfriend I had, yet. I had quite a lot of loves, but still I'm not going to tell them all. Oh, and by the way, there's a. I I promised you that I was going to tell why Yoka is no longer in my videos, but um, it's, it's a cancelled love and all expect a video from that okay all right so anyways well there's nothing really much to answer to this one i said i was a, a lot in love okay all right so uh what are your most thank what are you most thankful for this year well first of all i'm thankful that i'm still alive <laughs> same same uh, 
same. Uh, second of all, I'm thankful that, um, well, that I got I got some hugs from people and all. You know that I felt feel lonely when people don't <laughs> hug each other and all. That's great, I guess. I really don't know why I can be thankful. I'm thankful that basically I'm still alive and. I really don't know anything yeah. else I could be thankful. Yeah, I'd say yeah, I, I'm thankful for having a roof over my head and having food on the table and being alive. So that's basically it for me, you know. <laughs> well, oh, okay. Yeah. So there you have it. It's a bit of a short video, I know, but we came to a point where we just ran out of quote-unquote ideas. So anything else you want to say? Uh, yeah, um, it was a great time doing a collab. Uh, and don't forget to like and subscribe and check out my channel in the description. That's right, I'm gonna be leaving a link to this channel, so go ahead and spam his channel with likes and subscribers. Good stuff. Yeah, so anyways, that's the end of the David Fluffy show, so have a nice day and see you all next time. Are you gonna like jump out or something? Okay, I'll jump as well. We. Oui. Okay. Oh, 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 oh,